Hello, all creative content creators. In this video, I am going to show you how to create classic photo slide zoom blur transition inside Premiere Pro and add some sound effects, as you can see. So let's start. Now we are inside Premiere Pro. Here, you can see, I have already got five photos in my timeline. Firstly, I am going to create a photo slide zoom out blur transition on the second photo. Here, I am going to start by adding animation to the very beginning of the second photo. Now move over to the effects panel to add an effect. This is a Gaussian blur effect. Now, drag and drop this Gaussian blur effect to the second photo. Then, move over to the effect controls panel. And, move the playhead to the beginning of the photo. Then, click on the stopwatch icon to create this first little keyframe. And, make the blurriness value around 40. Now, move the playhead 6 frames forward. And here, make the blurriness value 0. Now, I am going to add another effect. This is a transform effect. Drag and drop this transform effect to the second photo. Next, move over to the effect controls panel. And, move the playhead to the beginning of the photo. And here, I am going to add some animation to the scale. Now, click on the stopwatch icon to create this first little keyframe. And, make the scale value around 125. Now, move the playhead 6 frames forward. And here, make the scale value around 110. And then, we can move like 2 frames forward to have it zoom out a little bit more. And here, make the scale value around 108. And then, to make it more smooth, select the last two keyframes. Then, right click and select Ease In. Again, select the first keyframe. Then, right click and select Ease Out. Now, I'm going to use the same transition effects for fourth photo. Now, we can copy and paste these effects that we added. So, we can press Ctrl to select both of the effects and press Ctrl plus C to copy them. Then, select the fourth photo and move over to the effect controls panel and move the playhead to the beginning of the photo and then right click and paste here or press Ctrl plus V to paste it. And now, it has applied to this photo. Now, I am going to create a photo slide zoom and blur transition on the first, third, and fifth photos. Firstly, go to the first photo. Here, I am going to start by adding animation to the very beginning of the first photo. Now move over to the effects panel to add an effect. This is a Gaussian blur effect. Now, drag and drop this Gaussian blur effect. Then, move over to the effect controls panel and move the playhead to the beginning of the photo. Then, click on the stopwatch icon to create this first little keyframe and make the blurriness value around 50. Now, move the playhead 8 frames forward. And here, make the blurriness value 0. Now, I am going to add another effect. This is a transform effect. Drag and drop this transform effect. Next, move over to the effect controls panel. And, move the playhead to the beginning of the photo. And here, I am going to add some animation to the scale. Now, make the scale value around 90. Now, click on the stopwatch icon to create this first little keyframe. And, move the playhead 8 frames forward. And here, make the scale value around 100. And then, to make it more smooth, select the last keyframe. Then, right click and select Ease In. Again, select the first keyframe. Then, right click and select Ease Out. Now, I'm going to use the same transition effect in the third and fifth photos. Now, we can copy and paste these effects that we added. So, we can press Ctrl to select both of the effects. And, 
press Ctrl plus C, to copy them. Then, select the third photo, and move over to the Effect Controls panel. And, move the playhead, to the beginning of the photo. And then, right click and paste here, or press Ctrl plus V, to paste it. And now, it has applied to this photo. Again go to the fifth photo. And move over to the Effect Controls panel. And, move the playhead, to the beginning of the photo. And then, right click and paste here, or press Ctrl plus V, to paste it. And now, it has applied to this photo. Now we are done. And, I am going to add, some sound effects. I have already got, two sound effects, from Mix Kit. One is camera shutter hard click sound effect, and the second is, antique movie projector spinning sound effect. Firstly, I am going to use, camera shutter hard click sound effect, as the slideshow effect. And, I am going to drag and drop this camera shutter hard click sound effect, into the timeline, at this point. I can press Alt key, and drag the mouse, to duplicate that. And just repeat that. And then, I am going to drag and drop this, antique movie projector spinning sound effect, into the timeline. And, cut at this point. And, delete the extra part. Now, select the sound effect, and move over to the effect controls panel. Now, decrease the volume level. Now we are done. Let's preview the classic photo slide zoom blur transition. In this way, you can create classic photo slide zoom blur transition inside Premiere Pro. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like the video and leave a comment.